Row 0 is a next-gen spreadsheet built for big data. In this video, we'll show how to map zip codes to states, counties, and metro areas, and look up zip code demographics so you can easily enrich your customer data sets. To help you get started, you can open our zip code data and mapping template, which I've opened here. And this is linked in the description and contains comprehensive zip code data from the U.S. Census. It has mappings of zip codes to all U.S. location levels, as well as comprehensive demographic data by zip code. To demonstrate, I'm going to import a customer data list, and this is a fake customer data list. Make my file and import. Okay, and I want to enrich this data set with state, county, metro, population, and median income by zip code. I can easily do that with an XLOOKUP. So let me equals XLOOKUP. And my key is going to be the zip code. And my lookup range will be the zip code column in the sheet. And my lookup, my return range is going to be the state. And if nothing is found, I'm going to return blank. And you notice nothing came in here. And that's actually because this zip code is in number form. I need to convert this to text form. When you're doing an XLOOKUP, it's really important that um, both the key and the lookup range are in the same format. And with zip codes, sometimes uh, the data is not in text format, and so you need to make sure that it's always in text format uh, so the XLOOKUP works correctly. So the point correctly with California. I'm going to do it again here for county. So XLOOKUP the key, and I'm going to go find the county and return the county and return nothing if it's blank. And then I can do the same thing with metro. Let's look up. There's my key. Go find the metro. So my lookup range is the zip codes. Return range is the metros. Return nothing if it's blank. Got my metro. And then for population and median income, I'm going to do next lookup on the demographics sheet. So my key will still be the zip code. I'm going to navigate over to the zip code demographics sheet. And my lookup range is going to be the zip codes again. And my return range is going to be the population. Turn nothing with blank. And one more time to get the median income. Close X lookup. Here's my key. And zip code demographics. Lookup range is the zip codes. And my return range is the median household income. I'll return nothing if it's blank. And I have my median household income. And now I can format this real quick and dollars and then I can just select these and scroll down and drag to dynamically bulk update all of my customer data with state, county, metro, population, and median income. So as you can see it's very easy to map zip code data to any location level and look up zip code demographic data to enrich your data set. And since row zero is a thousand times more powerful than traditional spreadsheets, you can easily work with multiple large data sets in row zero. You can try row zero for free at rowzero.io and see why row zero is the best spreadsheet for big data.